<laughs> hey. I like their hey. titty cover coverings. Hey. JT, that's what the first thing, JT, that's the first thing people have now heard <laughs> while live. <Damn. laughs> Hi, chat. Hi. Chat, no, go away. We're having a talk we're about having... the birds and the bees. They're fine. Most of our, most of our, most of our adults. Most. No, they're all children. I was like, I was like, who the fuck joined? Get the fuck out of here. Oh wait, it's Jess. <laughs> I thought it was like, <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was like someone else had joined from the server, but no, it was just Jess. I thought like someone else had no, joined. No, just Jess. Jessica, can you do me a favor? Yeah. What is it? Will you come get me a strawberry water? Yes. Yes, are master. Are you weird people to put, like, fruit on the edge yes, of the glasses? Yes, master, anything for you, master. <laughs> I literally just cooked you fucking dinner. <laughs> Thanks for ruining my notes, eh? It was literally on the other side of the goddamn table. I know! I'm aware, but I'm opening up my notes. <laughs> yes, master, anything for you? I'm never cooking for you again. Never I feel again. absolute concern. You should for her well-being. I'm gonna die one of these days because of peach. yeah. Don't eat the I food. It's poison. Don't eat the food. It's poison, so that means I don't have to live anymore. Exactly. Yeah. It's not the poison that you want, though. So painful death is still death. <laughs> No, no, it's the poison that you used on the eels, remember? Oh, the ones that make them stronger. <laughs> yeah, the ones that make Some you stronger. No, it's the poison that slowly kills you, but then when it does finally kill you, it brings you back, kills you, brings you back, kills you, bring, brings you back, kills you, over and over again. So I'm just gonna be Kenneth. Yeah, but quicker. <laughs> quicker Kenneth, that sounds like, uh, that sounds like something. Who died? Me. Kit did. Oh no, Kit. Kit. Oh Jesus oh. fucking! I'm sorry. If I get DMCA striked, I know who I'm blaming. <laughs> anyway, hi Twitch. Hi Twitch. I am dying. Please no. Well, stop. Well, if we're taking the time to speak to Twitch, I hope everyone in chat had a very lovely Valentine's Day. And even if you spent it alone or with no Valentine at all, that's a okay. I hope you had fun anyway. We'll be your Valentines. <laughs> Mwah. 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 Only if you want it, though. I'm taking it's Valentine's platonic. request for the day. For the next three hours, I will be your Valentine, but you're going to have to donate bits to Lois first. <laughs> you have to I'm pay. still waiting to reach my, what I want. I'm so close to getting to I, how sorry, I want sorry. I ain't being a dick here. I only like people who do good deeds for others. Well, I don't deserve good deeds, so fight me. Yes, you fucking do. Shut the fuck up. Mm. Kit, I see you. What do you mean you see me? I'm roll 20. Shit. <laughs> dollar for every time somebody messed with the goddamn map on roll 20 we would have a decent amount of money to why what the fuck did you people do you know, money to know, buy just... fantasy grounds oh god just going based off of how much it happens anyway hello everyone welcome to a double session weekend again because we have nothing to do with our lives and it's valentine's day so you know what why not um no, don't worry, this won't be like a common thing. We just got really lucky both last week and this week. The fact that we had things prepped and every one of us was free just want to play. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, we won't be able to do this. We're probably not going to do this next other, week. <laughs> or any time in the future until I'm done with classes or I know I don't have class on Mondays. Yeah, so like... Yeah. This summer. will probably become a common occurrence in the summer, but... Semi-common. Uh, yeah. Semi-common, yeah. It it's going to move the last week, isn't it? No! Bird, that hurt me! Oh, God! <laughs> but yes, again, double sessions. We played, oh. we played last night. We're playing again tonight because you know we got nothing better to do right now. And you know what? We love you guys. You guys love us, I think. So hey, and we're in combat if right now. If you didn't love us, you wouldn't be here. So some yeah. 
Also, Lois, you yes. have something to show them. Burbs and all Burbs artwork and also um the thing that uh so I will show that just a moment. <laughs> yes, again, I'm just gonna go to <laughs> That was either a really good compliment or a bad burn. No, I just started to dislike because I was trying to find something at the same time. Like I can't multitask for shit. Um No, like you're like, here's Burbs artwork and then here's the thing Peach made. <laughs> I meant the to thing be. is that I have more than like three uh, theories based off of just that one thing alone. Okay, so before uh, before we do, before I show off the artwork and stuff like that, uh, would anyone, would somebody like to get the recap, or would, would you guys want me to get the recap again? Well, chat. We became furries except for Brooke. That's <laughs> an oversimplification. Yesterday, I don't remember. So so far, uh, the chat the the party has been in combat like for. It lasted five hours for us, but in game it's lasting like what, maybe uh -huh. barely a minute and a half. Yeah. Um, Brooke has decided that she loves to do friendly fire. Shut. Um, and everyone except for Brooke is currently uh, cursed with lycanthropy. Kenneth and Darius are currently cursed with corrupted lycanthropy, and they were both turned into snakes for half a round. But friendly fire helped us. Yeah. These potatoes are so good. God damn. I know, right? Yay, friendly fire. <laughs> so, some shit's going down. Um, We'll see what happens. <gasps> Hi, Nagrom! Howdy, howdy. Hi, Nagrom. How are you? I'm underrated as well. Welcome. And Nagrom, thank you for the two months of support with that tier one sub. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, usually we'd have a better recap, but literally oh, last yeah. session combat. Yeah, it was um, mainly we combat. Found some things in their previous room, which I will show nothing. In a second. Yeah, <clears throat> nothing has truly happened yet, except for the combat where they're getting their asses kicked. Yeah. Um. So first things first, I'm gonna I show. I finally off... have enough points for what I wanted to do. Oh no. Um. Uh, first things first, I'm gonna show off this drawing that Peach made. Um. Pretty much in the last room we were in before this combat. We were in this room, and there was this mural uh, carving on the wall, and uh, this drawing is what was depicted, pretty much. This is what we saw on the ceiling of this uh, prayer room, as you could call it, and um, this is the drawing depicting both life and death. The woman's face, although was familiar, um, not familiar, although there was obviously like a woman's figure... Uh, the face was destroyed. So as if someone purposely destroyed the face and made sure that uh, it was unrecognizable. Probably. Mm -hmm. uh, also, there is text on it, but don't read it yet because no one's looked at it yet. And the next, the other thing is this beautiful hour done by Burb, our resident buoy player. And this is a drawing of Alina after me and him were like practicing with poses and this is the end result that he did. And I love the like, little signature. And we got, we, and this is what Alina's banishing arrow looks like. So whenever I say she uses banishing arrow, which is the one where she can teleport someone to the Feywild for a round, this is what it looks like. And she's also got a little, little mm -hmm. dragon kintry up in the corner, vibing. I would like to mention on stream, it does look a little awkward. It's kind of cropped, weirdly. Yeah. I There's nothing you can do about it, though. It happens. Oh my god, you actually say that for the flex points, Jess. Yes! <laughs> I've been waiting for so long. I only got 40 points left now. Good lord! Yeah, I flexed mine uh, a while ago and I feel only pain. Uh, I've been waiting so long to do okay, that. Okay, it's just rhythm ball. It's just rhythm ball. And we ended up last time, so we were in combat. Uh, this werewolf has been taunting the shit of Alina, because we find this corrupted werewolf thing. It looks kind of deformed, obviously not right. Um, we ended it off with actually Alina's turn in combat. What? Oh god, Peach, there's an echo coming from your mic. We can hear the music. Sorry, twice. hold on, hold on, sorry. Um, okay. So we ended it off, and I even put in here, it's in helpful notes. We ended the session with Alina about to have her turn, uh, which is, well, if anyone. God damn it. If anyone here who actually uh, is watching the campaign and knows the campaign, knows that Alina's my character, so I'm up! Yay! And I'm ready whenever you guys are. Sorry, it takes me a bit to respond. I am currently stuffing my face with chicken and potatoes. That's Yay. fine. Eat away. I second that. <clears throat> and, my good good, and my swabella water. Yeah. Okay. Lois? 
Um, oh shit, me. Should have Alina's character open this whole time. Sorry. Um, wow. Well, I'm sorry. For once, I'm actually the one who's not fully prepared. Um, I can't believe you. I know, I know. I'm a failure. Don't to remind me. My parents remind me that every single day. Um, <clears throat> oh, <laughs> support and love. Uh, just bad humor, bad humor. But anyway, um, so I think the last thing the werewolf did was it's on Brook right now. And let me just see how much movement speed I actually have. Uh, I could tell you what it did last because I have the notes. That's fine. Okay, 15. I can make that because I have the same movement speed. Uh, at least I have 35 movement speed, so I think I have enough. Yeah, I have plus five. Well, I have like half that left. Uh, I also have 28 C right now because Bowie has your faith in me. But uh, instead of um, attacking it, uh, I asked Peach this last night if I get what her was take a bonus action or an action. She said full action. Alina is going to pull out her silver dagger and she is going to attempt and she's going to slide it as far as she can uh, over towards Darius so that he now has a weapon that can do damage. Um, and using the rest of my movement speed well, using my movement speed I'm going to move up at least gonna, at least she's going to move up next to this thing, even though difficult terrain as well um, mm -hmm. and she's going to do her best to attempt to get in between Brooke and the werewolf but I don't think I can't do an action at the moment but she's still like there for like trying to do her best to get mm -hmm. Nagrom uh, she's going to do her best to get in between uh, the werewolf and Brooke. And she's gonna just, yeah, you just, you know, Brooke, get out of here. Please. Don't have to tell me twice! That'll be the end of my turn. Alright, next up is Darius. <clears throat> oh, Darius is on top of the stairs, so if he wants to get the dagger, he has to get off the stairs. Wasn't he below it? I can't remember. No, he's on top of the stairs. Okay. I'm a dumbass. Hey, Peach, I need help. Can you use the ruler to help me? I can't. I'm on mobile. Alright, what are you trying to do? Uh, can you tell me the distance between me and my bear trap? And from the bear trap and those buckets of blood? Between the bear trap and the bucket? The bucket? Yeah. 25 feet from the bucket to the bear trap, and then 50 from you to the bear trap. Uh, okay. Fuck it. I have 70 feet of movement speed when I use the dash action. I'd like to drop off from the... I'd like to jump from the balcony and start running towards my bear track. If applicable, I'd like to pick up the dagger on the way, but if it's out of the way, I'm just going to ignore it for the time being. Okay, um, would you like to walk down the stairs a bit? Um, because where you are right now, you'll take some fall damage. I don't got enough movement speed to do that. God All gave right. me... Puff legs for a reason. It's about 10 feet high, would you say? Mm-hmm. I don't know. I do a fifth point for damage watch, but... Five so, points of damage. There's about where the dagger is, by the way, on the map, because 20 feet. Because you can, you can go drag a 20 feet fine, Eight, so... Is also, is JT quiet for anybody else? Yeah. Oh, he's very quiet. He's on phone. He's on mobile. I have a turn. I have oh, okay. I turn. I'd like to... Uh, stop me if I don't have enough actions to do so. I would okay. like to uh, try and pick up my bear trap and take it over to this bucket and dip the the tips in the blood. Okay. Um. Would you have to get the dagger as well on your way by? Assuming I'm able to. Yeah, I would say that you're able to run by it. Um. I want to say that it would take your two uh, actions to pick up the dagger and then the the bear trap, so you could do the tip it, dip it into the bucket on the next turn. That's fine by me. Okay. That'll be the end of my turn. All right. Next up is Kenneth. Since Brooke is so close to the werewolf, he's going to book it and try to tackle. I forgot how to tackle. Uh, what were we saying? Was it a grapple? Yeah, shove, shove action. Just uh, it's shove action, but like, uh, 
you, you go with it kind of thing. So if you like push it five feet, you also go the five feet with it. So what do I roll for shove actions? Uh, let me double check. I believe. Give me a second. Shove action is go away, Dee. To be honest, I don't care about your Valentine's Day stuff right now. I want to check out this ability. Um, you must make a, a strength athletics check opposed by the target's uh, strength athletics or acrobatics of their choice. For it's you, you have to make an athletics check. I can make an athletics. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you have to make an athletics check, and the defender, which would be the werewolf, gets tr gets the choice between athletics or acrobatics of its choice. Hey, it's better than just strength. My strength is just a pure d20. Mm -hmm. do, 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 do. Have to wait for the load before I realize my oh. ass. Mm -hmm. In the chat, how do you. What's the command for the um the party? Because I'll let see. D&D play, as I'll do it now. Okay. There we go. I never remember that one, sorry. Yeah, it's D&D, &D, there's D&D, D&D players, and then Calamus. That's the three commands. Calamus brings you to episode one. At least links you to episode okay. one. Okay. You're welcome. Plus three. Come on. So why we load things beforehand? I had things loaded beforehand. Your athletics is a plus three. Oh, I know. I was trying to get it to type. 22. Oh. You pass. So he's tackling the wolf to the ground and being like, you leave her the fuck alone. And I don't have any magical weapons, so. Apart from your short bow, but you can't, you know. Wait. Since you I'm used to shove that. Looking at... Yeah, wait, that's an action. Never mind. Mm -hmm. Uh, I have a question for Lois or JT. Yep. Um, so he tackled him. That moves them both back five feet, correct? Yeah. If that, yeah. Okay. That's what we're looking at. No, not entirely. Uh, when you take the shove action, you gotta move them back five feet or knock them prone. So yeah, they're prone. From the way, from the way, um, correct me if I'm wrong here, Jess, but from the way you're speaking, it sounds like you were trying to knock it prone. And they, she tackled him. In which case, it would be knocked uh, five feet back. Also, um, one thing to notice about that the shove action can replace one attack, So, but you, you but you are a rogue, so you do not get more than one attack, so that is your entire yes. attack action. Yeah, yep. okay. Is that the end of your turn? Yep. That's all I'm able to do. Brooke. Alright, so I'm no longer... So am I in its attack range still, or...? I don't know, are you? No, you're not. Maybe. You're not. Uh, okay. Kenneth, is Kenneth is in the way. Oh, I forgot to dump it. Okay, I would like to... Boner action cast... No, wait. Why do I think that was a boner action? No. I, I'm... My brain! session... At at the end of last session, you casted Shillelagh. Okay, thought so. Okay. All right, I already did that then. Yeah, no, I'm gonna keep Shillelagh active, but I am going to back the frick away. Okay. Uh. Remember the red circle that you in currently that you are in currently is difficult terrain. All right, and that's 10 feet, that's 10, so that's... 20. 20 feet that would take me, so then 20, 5, 30, 35, 40, all right. Yeah, I'm moving myself right there. Okay. Then, as just a bit of insurance, I will be going to wild shape back, back into the black bear. Can you, oh yeah, mm -hmm. that's full, yeah. Yeah, and that's the end of my turn. Alright, next up is Bowie. You are muted, Burb. Okay. Also, Jeff. 
I just noticed something in the Nightbot thing. I am the only person whose name is not capitalized. I am happy. <laughs> <laughs> I just noticed that. Anyways. So. Going to use some of my movement in order to move towards this part of the balcony. I can still see the wolf, right? Oh, yeah. Wolf. Um, also, right now, you're standing inside that circle. That's difficult terrain for the bottom thing. No, right? no. We talk about you're, the red you're on that um, the teleportation circle up, up on the top. Pretty sure it doesn't work until I, you know, cast magic on it. I assume. Um, now that you're on top of it, you are able to see that it is made of blood. Oh, lovely. Delicious. Delicious. Time to lick it to see what creature it is. And, and <laughs> no. <laughs> Anyways. Plus, I already made that joke last session. No. So, it's not about the damage. It's about how it's about how many times we can fuck this thing over. So, my last thing that I'm gonna do is use the last alchemy fire that I have. Okay. Range, ranged attack. I can discount. Also, it. for the ones that are new in chat, this creature's AC is 20. I, I can use improvised weapon attacks on this. Okay. Mm -hmm. You have a time roller. Yep. So it's a plus 8 to hit. Nice. And do you mind if I use inspiration to give myself advantage on this? Go ahead. Come on. Ready. Come on. It's a plus eight. Oh. oh. That's. Uh... That's the last bottle of alchemy fire too. Mother. I have four. It's fine. You'll get more. It's also, not I realize I do have uh, ball bearings, but they're all random sized. Yeah, I have to get the stuff. I have to find that stock box for that because I do have that. Oh, God. This is such bullshit. <laughs> the dice of being mean again. <laughs> I wonder what um, happened. The dice are again. being mean again. <laughs> What happens if I actually roll again? Watch. Oh! <laughs> no. Get fucked! This is some bullshit. <laughs> rigged. The dice are rigged. Is the that gonna be your return, Burb? <laughs> you know what? Let's see here. Oh, that's funny. I'm sorry. Let's see here. Uh, Should be. Fuck it. Use the rest of my movement speed to jump down on top of it. Oh my god. Alright, give me a second. I need to roll that damage for the fall. So you're going to take five points of fall damage. Hey. <clears throat> Is that going to be the end of your turn? Is this you effectively, like, grappling it? Is this what this is technically? Basically, I'm just trying to fall on top of it. I don't know what you count that, that as, but oh well. Basically what well, Brooke did with her misty step. Oh, yeah, okay. So you can choose where you would land um, after you would fall on top of it. Okay, right next to it. All right, awesome. Is that the end of your turn? Yep. All right, well, I need Bowie, Kenneth, and Alina all to make strength saves. Hey, I'm, ra I'm enraged still because I took- Why did it have to be me. strength? I don't know. Why does it have to be strength? Natural 20. <laughs> Fuck yeah, 21. Well, uh, let me double check that my, yeah, my strength is as bad as I thought. 18 because fucking enraged. Two. Oh my god! What? Not 20. Oh my god. 
Can I just say the fact that every, sing every single strength save that I've rolled at the moment, I've had, like, above an 18. I think I've rolled two nat 20s for my strength saves at the moment. Like, the in this entire really combat. System, don't get excited about the nat 20. When I say it got nat 20, that's not a good thing. <laughs> the dice <Bye>. is rigged. <laughs> okay, hold on. Goddamn two. Alright, you get sent back. You get sent back. Um, I have to make another red circle. Hold on. You all get sent back! I love oh, that Owen is holding on. No, that's not what yeah. I needed. Fuck. I love that she's able to hold- she's holding on. It's- it's- it low-key is just fits so well, the fact that she's actually just seen these strength saves. Even though her strength is shit. I mean, her strength is- like, I mean, plus one strength in terms isn't shit, it's just in comparison to this monster and, like, maybe one, like, two fifths Exactly! Apart. I said it's shit! <laughs> plus no. zero! No, mine's shit! Hers is at least okay! It's the fact that the dice is rigged. Hold on, I'm sorry, I'm doing- it. Rule 20 is being a bitch. So, the usual- Fuck! One. The usual bitchiness. If I move it, yeah, the circle goes with it. Because of course it does. It can't just stay in place, can it? Huh? Nope. How do you make that fucking circle that the red one is? Uh, draw shapes, I think. I don't have a- I only have squares. I don't have- is, Isn't you hold shift? Hold- No, hold alt. alt. Hold alt for a circle or an eclipse and hold shift to snap it to the grid. I have a Mac. I don't know what button this is. Do you need one of us to make it for you? Yes, I do. Oh shit, I got you the leader. Hold on. I'm gonna use the one that Brooke has. Delete? I actually deleted the leader, trying to delete the circle. It's fine. Good job. <laughs> to the general, we now lost already damaged dealer. No. I That's have. I can't. Why, I, have to, I don't have to do it. But thank you. Delete. Delete. Go. Hold on, Alice. I'll get you, Alina. Yeah, there. take take your time. No, no rush. Where was she? She was right there. She was. Uh, yeah, right there. There, diagonal to the okay. werewolf. All right. Hold on. I have to roll damage for the two of you. Also for Lois. How? Let me guess. Twenty-three damage. Uh, 12 for Bowie. That's half, because resistance. Uh, 14 for Kenneth. And 12 for Alina. And the area around it now is difficult terrain. Um, Lois, you're about to get, um, opportunity attack. Okay. Actually, wait, do I? No, I, I, wait, I don't, because if anything moves away from me, I only have a bow, so I cannot melee attack it. Ah, well, that sucks. Hey, uh... So... Give me a moment. My computer is deciding to do the big lag. All right, cool. That's what I thought. All right, stop that. <laughs> All right, I have a something for you, Kit. How lovely. Hold on. Go away. No. Go away. No. I said go away. Okay, please stop with the bird, please. Sorry. You're fine. Oh. Hold on. I have to... Just please go away. No. We can no. talk about this. We <laughs> can right. talk about this. He's going to stop here. Um, You watch as a wall just grows up from the ground behind you. Um, as he casts, uh, Mold Earth. What? 
Ja. 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 What's your AC? As a bear. Eleven. <laughs> Isn't it? I remember yeah. the last time it's eleven. It's eleven. <laughs> Hold on, I have to roll to hit you twice. Uh, 17, that's a hit. And 11, that's a hit as well. <clears throat> Hold on a second. How much HP do you have as a bear? 19. That's 10 points of slashing damage. As it, uh, it's slashing you with its claws. It comes at you, immediately just starts whamming at you with one of its hands. Um, give me a moment. And then an additional 10 points of damage as it sinks its teeth into your, sh uh, your bare shoulder. All right, I am now person again. That only did one damage to me, though. That's good. <laughs> Otherwise, it would have done more than... <laughs> God. Huh. Shit, 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 shit! It grins down at you and turns its head to look at it, Alina. It holds out one of its clawed hands to you, Alina. It makes a beckoning motion. That will be the end of its turn, and Alina, it's your turn. Well, fuck. <laughs> um. Okay, so I luckily I can move here because I just checked it. So up here I go. Uh, shove action. I'm gonna make a athletics check. That's an 8. I rolled a 26. Well, Sylvanas gave Alina two actions for two attack actions for Arena, a, a reason, so here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Arena. <laughs> I got fucking tongue tied. If you're going to steal my line, at least do it right. Come on, <laughs> Shut <man>. up, Jay. <laughs> Shut up. I tried. I tried. <laughs> <laughs> I oh my god. Oh, and I rolled an 8. I rolled a 16. The dice wanted uh, me to die today. Oh, that sucks. I tried to shove <laughs> it. God, I'm trying to think what she would say because I don't want her to say something. Crap. Me, I literally had like daydream about this earlier in the bathroom. Like, oh, what would I need to say? Oh, this is a really cool idea. Me doesn't write it down. I do that all the fucking time. Yep. I hate it. Yep. Stop calling us out like this. I'm gonna call you out like this. Um. I want another water. She's just gonna just look at it and kind of just have this like again, just kind of this light growl and just um <clears throat> and just say to the the monster. Okay, I can't really like do the voice right now because it's so late at night for me, but whatever. Um. Kill me before you kill them, because I'm not going down easily. He grins back at you in response. Which is quite terrifying as there's blood dripping from his teeth that are exposed as well as bone parts from his face. Will that be the end of your turn? That will be the end of my turn. It is good old Darius. Well, you guys go plan the dirt over there. I'm just going to give my the, the tips of my bear trap a good old in the blood. <laughs> okay. Give me a minute. Oh, god damn it. It really <laughs> takes time. What do you need? I need the power of the lord. Let I can't think. get that to you, I'm sorry. 
I am a tactical genius. Can you hear this blue? Can you please keep that there? Yeah, let it yeah. Got it. Thank you. I'm, I'm a tactical genius, and I need time to tacticate my tacticals. You know, whatever it is, it's all got to come down to Brooke, you know, playing well with the team. And I can tell it's not a strong suit this fight, but, you know, maybe just maybe it'll work. I'm going to move. There you go. <clears throat> Okay. I need to see if that's the right move. Just a minute. I know I should have been considering my action before my turn, but most of my turn was spent finding that water drop sound effect. All of them suck on the internet. <laughs> Valid. Do you need me to move the bear trap for you? I can get the bear trap in a second. <sighs> then if you the ruler again. If it makes you guys feel any better, you have him at um, below half health. Oh, he's about to not take any damage. That'll be my <laughs> turn. Got you now, bitch. It is now Kenneth's turn again. Okay, he is going to shoot his plus one bow. Do it. Roll to hit. No. Do it. That's a miss. Uh, so fucking close. So it just barely misses. He gets pissed off. Runs over. And actually, no, that's a bad idea because if I push him, it's going to be closer to Brooke. So actually, let's do... Stay ranged, please. You could do both from the green. I mean, I could... They won't do anything but, to me. Good. Yeah, that's my point. <laughs> you do have spells. I don't know. But what none you, of them are a bonus are you, action. I uh, have enough movement. You can't get there because you're walking through people. It's called shove them aside and walk past. Friendly creature is kind of difficult to raise, but you can move through the squares if I do remember the rules correctly. I can't hear JC at all. Oh my god. Friendly boils count as difficult terrain. Yeah. Um, I don't see. Am I only able to do that? Mm. Mm. Yeah, that's like the only thing I could really do. Hey, so, where did Kenneth gonna... go? I don't see he's him. In, he's in one of the four squares that are wherever I'm peeing because I accidentally moved him at one point and I don't know which one exactly he was in. He's in that one. Okay. Since I don't have any other I'm, attacks. Hold on. Please. I have to move him down. He was here. Thank you. Since he doesn't really have any other attacks, he's gonna disengage. And then she bolts from the grave because it's the only thing okay. he could do a double. Are hit. you sure you wanna do that? Because it's not gonna affect him in any way, even if you do hit him. Well then that's the end of my turn unless he moves closer. Look him that close. Alright. It is now Brooke's turn again. You have uh one way to go. Because he blocked your other exit with a wall of dirt and stone. Yeah. Oh, God. So, it's since Shillelagh technically isn't concentrate, even then I can still concentrate on things. Shillelagh would still be active, even though I wild shaped, correct? No. Uh, I think Why? it would be because it's not a concentration spell, and I don't think wild shape affects. And even then, during wild shape, you can concentrate in spells. No, as long I as know. You cast them but beforehand. Shillelagh is this. Uh, deactivate it if it leaves your hand, and you're technically not holding it when you're in wild shape. Hang on. Uh, I never told you how I, I how I flavor my wild shape. <laughs> uh, for the duration, you can uh, you can use your spellcasting abilities. Blah, 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 blah. Um, the weapon is also. Awesome. 
the weapon ends if you cast it again, or if you let go of the weapon. I I, just can't, I can't spell shillelagh for the life of you. I'm checking. I'm double checking. Uh, I'll I'll let you have it. It's you still have okay. it. Okay. All right. Yeah, in that case, I mean, it doesn't really matter because I could just recast it anyway. Yeah. This better be the right call. I'm gonna try and hit it. Okay. Damn it. Bad call. Hold on. This bludgeoning damage shit. Uh. It could still hit, technically. I know I won't do any damage, but... I'm gonna try and unarm strike it. Okay. You haven't, you haven't got the magical fisting power yet. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I'm not going for damage. I am not going for damage. Oh, that's so funny. I have the crusher feet, though. No, what does that do? That did message. <clears throat> well, since I got a crit on it, anyway, once per turn when you hit a creature with an attack that deals bludgeoning damage, you can move it five feet to an unoccupied space, provided the target is no more than one size larger than you. When you score a critical hit that deals bludgeoning damage to a creature, attack rolls against that creature are made with advantage until the start of your next turn. Okay, so it doesn't, know, it doesn't do any bludgeoning damage because it's immune, but you can move it to wherever you want within... The Wait, feet. wouldn't it technically count as even like the attack itself deals bludgeoning damage, but the attack it doesn't feel damage? Say that again. The attack itself does technically deal bludgeoning damage. You just the damage doesn't affect him. Yeah, it does damage, but it doesn't affect him, so it doesn't. There's no point in rolling for it, really. Yeah, you. you so. Oh, yeah. no point in rolling the damage. You mean? No, there's no point in rolling the damage because it's not gonna. Do anything okay, but th do the effects it. from Crusher still apply, though, correct? Yeah, yeah. Okay, sorry, I thought you were saying that. Yeah, so he moves five feet back, so right here. Okay. And then I am going to move myself. Uh, I'm going to move myself to the blood buckets then. And don't forget, because of the crush of feet, we now, everyone has, I think, advantage now on attack rolls until your next turn. Until the next and end of my next turn. Oh, thank goodness that worked! Oh, God! Did you have enough movement speed to move there? Yeah, huh? she, yeah she never moved, so, and, she has, and she's a monk who has, like, ridiculous movement speed. Oh, uh, yeah, and that was only 30 feet, I have, but I have 40 foot okay. movement speed. Is that gonna be the end of your turn? That's the end of my turn. Oh, thank goodness. Ooh. <sighs> <sighs> Alrighty. I have no idea what to do now. All my attack options are gone. My restraining options is gone. Hmm. All my spell slots are gone. Hmm. Does holy water affect um werewolves or no? Mm, not I don't think so. No, it doesn't. The power of Christ compels you! The power of fate, I mean, Jesus compels thee! <laughs> <laughs> does it, Jay? Does it really? Hmm. Oh my god. Hmm. What do you have? I'm just thinking. Yeah, sorry if I'm really slow no, at you're that. you're fine. Hmm. Okay, yep. Right around here. Gonna use feline agility to go all the way over there. In order to protect the book, and let's see what everyone's HP is at. I'm fine. Everybody'd... Okay, Booby's going to do her channel divinity, preserve life. 
So how much HP can die with you real quick? Where's my fucking calculator? I swear I'm aging, guys. <laughs> Darius heals for 11 HP, and let's see here. I heal myself for... For 12 HP, which is... Yeah, that's 25 in total, okay. Yeah, that's gonna be the end of my turn. Alright. Give me a second. What's Brooks AC? Seventeen? Eighteen. Eighteen? What's Bowie's? Seventeen. And Kenneth? 18. Okay. I'm only asking so I can write it down. Sure. Fear. <coughs> <coughs> you okay? <coughs> Stop dying. Breathe, please. You're not, you're I not demand you to cease your death. Hey, Lola, server meet me real quick. Yeah, give me a second. Uh... <laughs> Done. We're supposed to die, not her. God damn it. <laughs> uh... Big oof. She's fine. Oh, I was shaking when I decided to do that. I'm just saying. I That could have fucked me over so hard. Well, everything's going fine, guys. A little death never killed anybody. What I did was a good call, right? <laughs> yes. Right? Yes. Yeah. I'm confused. What I miss? I used the crusher feet on it. Um, I missed my initial do? attack, but I thankfully have a bonus action where I can attack. And I got nat 20 on it, which gives you guys advantage on the attacks. Oh. Until then. Till my next turn. Um, yeah, I was hoping that the uh... crusher would at least hit. Yeah, that no, I was hoping my staff would hit. But the fact that the punch hit is all that that mattered because I got it to move away so that when I moved, it would provoke an opportunity attack. That's essentially what I was aiming for was to get damage and or the. Uh, the advantage, and then myself move away, so it's like I'm not just being a coward. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. Um, yeah, you good now? My body, my body decided that it was time for me to get sick. Oh, oh no. You're, you're okay now? Yeah, um, I didn't get sick, but I may end up having to mute again soon. Alright, just do it whenever you need to. Yeah. Okay. Uh Darius, your AC is seventeen. You'll let a symbol only for shield of faith. That is a hit. Um JT make a string save. You're saying bro scrawny. <clears throat> 
27. All right, that's good. Um, you're right. You're going to take 14. I get that my fucking my hand this day. Jesus Christ. I... <laughs> you're going to take 14 points <laughs> of bludgeoning damage. <laughs> um, <clears throat> 14 points of sludging, uh, yeah, sludging, bludgeoning damage. Um, and you're going to be pushed back 10 feet, but you're not going to be knocked prone like you would have been otherwise. I'll let you decide what 10 feet you go. There you go. I need <clears throat> Ice Maker, shut up. <laughs> Is that... lower. Yes. I need you to resist a grapple. Mm, acrobatics, because I'm good at this. I'm going to die, you guys. I'll be fine. Please don't die. Please don't. We need you. It's fine. You're gonna lose. I swear, if you get a nat fucking... What? Oh. <laughs> oh, wait. I Check. Acrobatics. Check. Uh... <laughs> Look, I never said I had I had a, had a high intelligence score. That's a 15. Ouch. <laughs> Whipper. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> I've always been able to make that sound. It's just that's the first time it's gotten caught on the mic, I guess. I. I rolled a 16. I hate myself. I'm gonna go kill myself now. <laughs> Please don't. Um, well. You're grappled now, but I'm gonna flavor it a bit. Um, as he 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 uses one hand to slam Darius away from him, and the other hand he reaches out and he grabs you by the throat and he picks you up. Um, I'm flying without uh, wings. Hang on, give me a second. Take your time. Oh, I'm in the air now. This is fine. Being strangled. <laughs> I'm fine, guys. I'm. She's fine. She's got 44 HP left. She's not gonna die. Maybe. Well, I'm all out of heals, so oof. I got heals. I got crusher feet. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Ow. You okay, Peach? Yeah, I'm fine. Sorry. Um, <sighs> I would like a session. I would like to have a session where I don't almost get sick. That would be amazing. <laughs> I concur. Um, I would also like a session where that happens. Yes, I agree. He's going to grin at you as he picks you up off the ground. He tightens his grip a bit. Not enough to hurt you too bad. Um, he said, well... Did say you wouldn't stop until I killed you. <coughs> so I take a little bit more than this. Okay, Peach, take your time. Valentine's Day, the day of love and also the day that we're all gonna die. How much a DM loves you? DPK. How much so much? <laughs> DPK. <laughs> now nah, we're fine. Oh. oh, excuse me. I think. Mm. All right.
right, let's try this again. God damn it. Maybe. Okay. What? Maybe not. I don't know. Maybe we won't try Maybe. again. Maybe. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. All right. He grins at you, um, at your response. And he says, I know you can feel it, little pup. You want to be evil. You want to cast aside all of these nice bonds you have with these people. Oh, this motherfucker. Just get into it. Oh, this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> we won't be in strangle. Like, I'm actually going to strangle myself. I'm kind of like, just... I don't. <clears throat> I am nothing like you. I will not give in. I've been fighting for a year. I'm going to keep on fighting until... <laughs> until I can. He doesn't say anything. He just grins at you. <laughs> That'll be good. Of oh, hey, it's my turn. Mm hmm? Well, shit, I'm being strangled, but, uh... Actually, fuck me, not me. I'm not gonna try myself also be putting presses against my throat actually too hard. <laughs> fuck. Uh, it's fine. Um, I'm fine. Lois? It's fine. Look, I know I have a death wish, but not not yet. Um, I'm gonna be nice and not say anything. <laughs> Shut Harder. the fuck up. Um, Harder, mommy. I'm gonna be mean and say something. Kinky. God. I am also gonna be mean and say something. Harder, mommy. Or in this case, Daddy. Nice one. I enjoyed that moment when Guardian said something, Peach. <laughs> nice rack. <laughs> uh, Very good. I also enjoyed that moment when you were mean and said something. <laughs> okay, let's get the show on the road. <laughs> yeah, I was trying to think what to do, but then I suddenly got distracted by people saying kinky. Um, uh, yeah, that too. <laughs> um, well, I'm gonna like, kind of like attempt to like try and break free the grapple by like, I don't know, like putting like my hands like around its uh hat, like I guess like wrist, I guess wrist forearm. That's like kind of I could like try and like pull my legs up and kick it off me. Yeah. So I. Those are thingies. Uh... Ow, that's an 11. I rolled a 12! I hate what myself. What is this shit? Do it again! Yeah, I'm doing it again. Come on, dice. <laughs> You're gonna win. I rolled a nat 1. 24. Yeah, I rolled in that one. Oh well, yeah, she's gonna kick it off of her, you know, fail first time, but kick again. Um, probably kind of like drop to the floor, maybe, and just. <coughs> <coughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. Just. Are you though? That's me, not him. Yeah, I'm very much fine. Thank you very much. Not as fun as you'll be very soon, though. She's gonna, you know, but I'll be the turn because I don't have any actions left. Alright, it's Darius's turn. <laughs> JT, is it Darius or Darius? I keep saying both. You are muted. I'm not JT, but I'm pretty sure it's Darius. If you're talking JT, you're muted. Might be busy a second. Are they okay? Intense music intensifies as JT's music. Welcome back. Oh, whoa. Alright. I assume it's my turn considering you're talking about my absence. Yeah. Alina kicked us, kicked off the uh, the werewolf, and she's just it's coughing been, on the ground. It's been 84 years, JT. Where did you go? Wrong did I know. That we were done ending. Where did you go, Cotton Eye Joe? Stop it. Uh, well, my turn three plans in the making, but they all come crashing down because I have Worlds of Darkness success rates here. 
but let's try it. What are you doing? Uh, well, it bit me, so what goes around comes around. I'm gonna try and hit it with my bear trap. Roll I'm to just gonna hold my bear trap in my hands and just smack it on there. Roll to hit. I don't know if this is actually allowed, so I do want to ask: Am I allowed to play by ear in regards to my actions? If I like, if I miss with my first attack, I'd like to attack again. If I hit, I'd like to do something else. Yeah, that's fine. If you hit, you can do something else. If you don't hit, you can do it again. Groovy. Thank you. I have a 3 in 10 chance of succeeding. So, uh, I hope this will win. Never tell me the odds. <laughs> nice. You got it. Thank goodness for that advantage, am I right? Yeah, cheers, Brooke. You hit him. I'm gonna go for your help here. Come and get some. <laughs> Why did you dip it in blood beforehand is my real question. Because maybe the blood is bad for it. Maybe it'll give it a blood board illness. Hey. <laughs> or maybe it's there for ambience and Peach doesn't actually do anything with the blood, but you know what they No, no, the blood's there for a reason. There's probably something at the bottom of the barrel. Brooke, I volunteer Kenneth for that duty because Kenneth <laughs> is resistant to the disease. So I mean, I'll... if he dies, he'll come back. So is Lena. I volunteer anyone but me for that duty. I, <laughs> I, <had a> <laughs> I think like... me and Billy just need a cold from. Roll your Maybe. damage. Ha! <laughs> ha! It's magic! It's not magic. It's a normal bear trap. Yeah, I thought so. I'm gonna roll damage to see what I would have gotten. Yeah. The blood is magic. No. Three points of damage. My second favorite thing to roll on a d4. Favorite thing to roll was a four. Wow, I didn't know. I yeah, thought, I thought, I thought, it was, I, thought I thought, I thought, I thought it was two. I just thought it was two because it was a nice even number, even number, you know. So in That's quick good. succession, Alina grabs onto its wrist and is able to kick herself off of it and it falls to the ground coughing um and talking to it and as she's talking to it and distracting it darius comes up from behind and just snaps the bear trap onto it he doesn't look happy but he doesn't seem like he's shown any pain like he didn't cry out in pain but he didn't look happy that you did it well i'd like to take the shove action now okay Twenty-five. 18. Oh, hey. I like we're just all put, we're all bullying this werewolf by pushing it around. That, that's <laughs> what else can we do? I forgot I have a knife. Oh, I'll be next round. Let me have this. I'd just like to point out I'm Johnny Cage, because I just I'm green buff and I just sort of slid in and kicked it back five feet. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Lloyd. Will that be the end of your turn? Yeah, I think it will be the end of my turn. It is now Kenneth Corn. Okay, who looks the most injured? All of them. I'm Actually, fine. I have the highest health. I'm, I'm doing fine. I'm pretty fine, honestly. I think the most injured is Darius. Is that how you say JT? Please tell me I'm saying it right. Darius. It's Darius. Darius. I, I dare you to pronounce it the right way. I keep saying it both ways because I never know which one's correct. So who has the lowest health? Darius. Okay. And Kenneth, but... <laughs> Kenneth's fine. No, he's it. not. <laughs> okay, so... He's going to shoot with his plus one bow with the werewolf. Roll the hit, please. I also, you, also, also you have advantage because Brooke hasn't had her turn yet, so... Yeah. 2d20. Keep lowest or keep highest one. Here, hold on. 2d20, keep highest one. And then your modifiers and everything. Yep, that's 26. a hit. Roll your damage. 
Let me double check all my damages because I'm under a different thingy. My status, JT. 1d6 plus 5. Don't say it out loud, it's a lyric. I oh. get the MPA struck. Chat, I need someone to rescue me. It's snowing outside, it's 95 degrees. I got hey, the lowest six, damage I could. Six. six damage is still six damage. And then, bonus action, I'm going to use Healing Light on Darius. Which, let me go back to that really quick. I'd just like to point out, this thing is riddled with arrows. Like, it's covered. Like, have you ever seen um, the movie Brave? It's yeah. Yeah, it's that. It, it looks like more do. That's terrifying. That just, huh. Like, arrows. you have weapons stuck in it, you have arrows stuck in it. It looks like more do. That is high key terrifying. <laughs> oh, Jessica, what did you say that you were doing for Darius? I am using Healing Light. Is there a range on that? Like 60, 60 foot. feet. 60, okay. You get healed for 1 and HP. I tried. <laughs> 1 HP and is 1 then, HP. Yeah. And just as an extra fuck you, because I had to do a bonus action before I could do it. We're going to just add another arrow, hopefully. With bolts okay. from the grave. You need to use Whoa. cutting action for that. Wait, is it a, I thought a bonus action and cutting action were the same thing, because that's what's in my notes. No, cutting action yeah. is something you could do on a bonus action. Yeah, which that sucks. You wasted a nat 20. Cause, yeah, why did you have to say that? We could probably just went past it for that round. Because Man. I'm but trying. Fucking 20. I'm trying to keep with the rules as best I can. <laughs> I had a nat 20. Because all the rogue players would scream. Yeah. That is unfortunate. That's their problem. <laughs> that is no rogue player yourself. So he's just gonna throw an arrow at the thing, and it's just gonna go like three feet and fail. But it's perfectly aimed for it. <laughs> because fuck you, that's why. Sorry. All right. Is that meaning your turn? Yeah. You, you still have movement speed. Fuck you, that's why. You still have movement speed if you wish to move. There you go. All right, it is Brooke's turn. Yeehaw. You are currently 45 feet from it, by the way. Yeah. Just okay. let me know. Okay. Okay. It is 45 feet. I could get the. It's it's technically possible, like. Will I be passing through them, or would I be, like, just narrowly passing them? I, I flavor. You can just be passing through by them, not through them. Okay. It's like you would be moving like this. Like, you're, that's your pathway, but like it would be like this. Yeah. So. All right. <sighs> yeah, that's all I can do, so I'm gonna... wrong thing shit uh right here i guess and mm -hmm. once again try and hit him with your shillelagh yep okay hold it 19 damn it ah bonus yeah. action we should get another nat 20 now oh! <laughs> fantastic do damage I can't do damage because it's just normal bludgeoning. <laughs> but you still knocked back. But it's still knocked it back five feet, and still now every, everyone gets advantage against it. Yeah. And oh so my <laughs> god, that's amazing! How the fuck? It's the same thing as last turn. Your last turn, you rolled a nineteen and then a twenty. What the fuck are the odds? <sighs> Holy I shit! Had twenty from earlier. <laughs> <laughs> I think I did. You the fucking mwah, chef kiss. 
That is amazing. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so it gets pushed back five feet. Five feet? Yeah. That's uh, amazing. Oh my gosh. And now everyone has advantage on it again. And I would like to, once again, move away. Do you have the uh, movement speed? I'm just... Oh wait, no, I don't. I can't. Right. That, that was my movement speed. Shit. Oh well. I'm here again. I'm just here. I'm like, huh. You come over and you try and whack it with the stick. It do it like it moves its head like down as you try to hit it to the head. It ducks down. You miss it and it grins at you. And then you're like, you know what? Fuck you. And you punch it square in the jaw. It stumbles back and then it snarls at you. I uh I smile and spit at the ground in front of it. Will that be the end of your turn? That is the end of my turn. Bully! Yeah, so you said that these things are riddled with arrows, right? Yeah. Do they still count as magical since they've been fired by a magic bow? No, I don't think so. <clears throat> no, unless, it, unless it they're a magical arrow itself, I think. Let me just read what the bow, like, a bow description in a second. Yeah, no, it doesn't say anything about arrows I don't being think magical. That's Sorry. Yeah, bows, they are not magical. Well, bow is magical, but arrows are not. Uh, I just feel like extremely useless now. Dear Lord. Burb, do me a favor. Only thing I can do is... What? Do me a favor. What is it? I'm gonna DM you something. Oh no. Also, idea. You could stand in front of Brooke, be an extra shield. Yeah, that is. Please don't! You wanna be bit? I don't wanna be bit, but I don't wanna use my friend as a meat shield. You don't have any problem with it before? <laughs> Listen, I wasn't directly using them as meat shields. They just happen to get caught in the line of fire. Do me a favorite, um, a favorite. Do me a favor, Burb, and roll perception. Alrighty, but let's see here. I'm, I'm also checking equipment and stuff in. Hmm. Let's see. Okay, first off, roll in perception real quick. Oh. But. Oh, come on! Uh, anyways. That's awesome. I'm actually really happy you did that. Right here, as you take a second to just try and think of what your plan is, you spot for the first time a small silver dagger that Ain't is that... covered in blood. Ain't that extremely convenient, you lord? No, actually, it has been there the whole time. No one's just... When everyone walked in, no one rolled perception. Damn. Hmm. Um, if you remember correctly, when you first walked into the room, the man, before he turned into a werewolf, he had numerous lacerations from something on his arms and chest. You can only assume that this is the blade that they used to cut him. Oh boy. But I'm also checking up a bunch of stuff at the well, does it cost an action in order to grab an item? I would say yes, because I made J I made JT use two actions to grab two items. Shit. Well, I I grab the blade, and that's all I can do. You now have a silver touch dagger. Yay. Will that be the end of your turn? Yeah, I was going to do something else before the perception thing, but oh well. Oh, this is glorious. I'm going to need everybody except for Kenneth to roll strength. 
Yay. Watch me get a fucking that one. Ouch. Six. <clears throat> I'm no longer okay. in rank two. This is some shit luck. Yeah. Alright, give me a moment. I have to roll some damages. Can someone hit me? Can I roll just to roll? Sure. Yay. Oh, Can someone hit me a circle really quick? Just one person, please. <laughs> Alina? 13. Yeah. You're getting knocked back 10. Uh, how much is it? Uh, hold on. Ten foot. Hold on. Uh, you're gonna be knocked down five. Uh, my brain. You're gonna be knocked back ten feet, and now you're not prone, and you're going to be taking seventeen points of damage. Which direction am I getting knocked? I'm getting. Huh? Which direction am I getting thrown? Uh, you choose. I, I always let you guys choose which way you're getting thrown. Can I can I just go into the the mold of and only move five feet instead? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll go up here. JT, you're not moving. Stay back. You get your points. head back. All right. Uh, Brooke, you're taking twelve and. The kitty cat is going to take 18. Um, you're both thrown back 10 feet. Uh, direction is your choice, and you're also not prone. Fun. Uh, Burb, go ahead and move your token for me. Alrighty. How many feet? 10 feet. Wait, was that 10 feet? Let me check again. Yeah, that's it. It is. Okay. <sighs> Hello, JP. How are you today? Doing pretty good. How much damage did I take from the shockwave, Elena? Oh, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> uh, you took 16? I feel like I may be floating up into the moonlight pretty soon here, guys. What's your ace, what's your health at? Four. Oh no, I'm so sorry. No, no, I'm gonna survive. I'm so sorry. I rolled a twenty-five to hit you for this it's next. Still three, it's still three damage in the past. That's um, you're unconscious. I'm gonna, he's attacking you after he slammed everyone away from him. Uh, he's also going to slash at you with his claws and deal eight points of slashing damage. Necrotic damage, too? No, no, just slashing. He didn't bite you. Oh, the can, cool. can someone make me a, a circle, please? Uh, give me a second. Also, the werewolf was here, right? I think I don't know. I, don't know if that's I about... think it was right here. I don't know if that's accurate. I don't know if you can edit that at all. It was right here. It was right there. Okay, hold on. I gotta fix the circle. Yeah. Do that. So all those circles now are—they're all to full terrain. Man, can't there's a wall in front of you, dude. Also, I have a, a gift for the person named Alina. Oh shit! What? What? Give me! Come on! Bring it to me! Oh, beautiful! Mwah. Love you too. <laughs> so he slams his fist down, causing all of you to just go flying. And then he, uh, Darius is able to hold on to the ground or something and be able to not be thrown back. Um, and then the werewolf stomps up towards him and slashes him across the chest. And Darius falls to the ground, uh, unconscious. Give me my dice a second, because I literally talked about this earlier. Oh, 
shit. <laughs> I knew it was gonna be him. I have a plan, don't worry. Where is that the one? Can't have Ikenberg if you're dead. Gotta find a specific dice. Ah, oh, there's the other one. Anyway, uh, God, it's my turn. That moment when you have too many fucking dice and you can't find that specific one. Alright, he's going to end his turn by howling in victory. And then now it's Alina's turn. First things first, I need to roll for composure. Give me a second. Uh -huh. Okay, she's still fine. Oh my god! Come on! I rolled a 35. No. I rolled a 35. I have to roll above, uh, let's see, right, right, right now I have to roll above a 75. Fuck! <sighs> you really want it to turn, don't you? I fucking want it to happen! I want you to finish this thing off with Alina turning into a werewolf. Um, keeping her composure, though, she's just, you know, I can't scream right now, but she's gonna scream Darius's name after seeing it go down. Um... And I'm gonna roll to attack it twice. Two D twenty plus thirteen. You can do it. Advantage. Uh, oh yeah, that's a good advantage. That is right. So that's one attack. So that's eighteen. Roll two D twenty. Eighteen plus thirteen. Uh, that is twenty. That's thirty something. Two D twenty plus thirteen. Two D twenty. It's thirty one. Keep. Uh, highest one. That's a twenty nine. Both it. Do your damage. 2d8 plus 16. 26 damage. Um, but she is still keeping herself calm, but a very cold look in her eyes. Oh my god, this... Oh, it's... Alright. Do you say anything? Do you do anything? Besides shoot it? She shoots it, and she just looks at it with this cold, this very cold look, and this other than just this, again, just again, a very similar low, soft, but quiet growl. Will that be the end of your turn? Yep. Alright, JT? I think this may be, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think this may be my first ever death save. It is, you're right. Oh, dang. The only person who's had to do death saves before, I think, is Kenneth. No, I mean, like, in any, any campaign ever I've ever been in. I think every oh. time I've gone down, someone's immediately picked me up before my turn again. Oh, wow. Well, don't pull a first death save like me and roll in that one. Please, oh, don't. Oh, don't. Oh, Congrat <laughs> Congratulations, JT. Oh, no. Please oh, no. Oh, no. It's going to happen. Oh, no. Please be not 20. I Please don't. Nine. <gasps> it wasn't a... Oh god! Oh no! Success. That is a success. Barely. That is a success, but barely. Oh my god! That is terrifying! Oh my god! <laughs> I don't want him to die! <laughs> Again, it's better than the nat one that I got on my first one. Oh my god! At least he succeeded. Right. You succeeded. It's now Kenneth's turn. Wait. Oh, wait. It's still technically my turn. I have a question, DM. Yeah? What even is the difficult terrain? I meant to ask, but uh, what's causing it? Like, the magic? Um, he slams his fist down on the ground, and it, like, uplifts the ground there. Like, it's like, the floor there is ruined. Like, it's sticking up. It's not. It's very difficult to walk on. You're slipping on rocks. Some of them are turning up out of the ground. Okay, overhaul. That's cool. Excuse me. Think Victor Amelia, basically, is what it is, when she slams her fist on the ground. And rocks go flying. That's the end of my turn. Okay. It's now Kenneth's turn. Okay, I'm gonna use the healing wand on Darius. Is there a range on it? No, because I never have the stat block again. Huh. You guys need to know I just know the magic word is Aura. And that's it. <laughs> you have to be able to touch the person. I don't know, what should that? Okay, well, shoot the dude with plus one bow. No, if I recall correctly, it was 
it casts healing word, which is a ranged spell. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, fuck, sorry. I Different thing. Okay, different item. Yeah, uh, you can go and he uh, roll for healing. What's the healing on that? Do, do you not have it? No, I don't. You never gave us a stat block. I could have swore I did. Nope. No. Healing it word was one of those is things a that we argued. Healing word is a D4, if I recall. Okay, thank you, Burb. I swear I gave you guys a stat block. That's two health with that. And then as a bonus action, we're going to use Killing Light on Darius. And let's see. Uh, should I use all of it? Yeah, I should use all of it. Because I know we're going to have a long rest soon. So that's 2d6. Is there a range on that, or is it just like, is it within 60 range? Feet. Okay, I'm just making sure. Come on, there we go. Ooh. Hey, Darius is revived. Welcome back. And I'm out of healing. Well, not completely, but magic wise. And. As soon as that happens, kind of like, bitch, we're not going down that easy. Especially with me here. And that's the end of his turn. His turn. All right. Um, let me check something. So... I mean, that's technically, it doesn't really matter anyway. Uh, don't need to calculate perfectly. I now have advantage because I'm flanking with Bowie. I mean, you had advantage anyway, didn't you? No, it's it ends at my turn. Ah, okay. Yeah. Go ahead and roll the hit. If the same thing happens again, oh my god. Well, I have advantage on this, and let's hope not. What did you do? I mess. I messed up. Let's just ignore that. <laughs> this is funny. Cool. I have one healing wand left. Yeah. The moment you use that healing wand, it breaks. By the way. Twenty six. That's a hit. Do your damage. And I have two heals on that last one. I know the one that you just used. Well, no, I have one left. I know. I was just telling you, the one that you just used broke when you broke. used it. Yeah. We're both just talking. Okay, that's seven damage. <sighs> and All then right. it gets moved five feet back. Uh, so I guess right here. Wait. Does that count when you're using an item, or is it like all automatic? It's just bludgeoning damage. Bludgeoning. Okay, where are you? Where's the five feet that it's going? Or do I get the shoes? Uh, it didn't stay. It just says it's get pushed five feet back, but I would hope, like, based on how I would move it, is I hit it from the side. Yeah, that's why I moved it where I put it. Alright, is that the end of your turn? Uh, I think I have enough movement speed to actually... M do I want to risk it? I have a question. Uh... The thing that you just hit it, was it with your fist or with the shillelagh staff? Staff. Okay, just making sure. Yeah, that's why I roll damage. How uh, much movement speed do you have? Okay, I was right here initially, so then that's... 20... You used 35 feet. Five. No, 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 so I was right here, so that's... Yeah. Then this is 10... You're in difficult 20, terrain. 25... Oh yeah, you're right, that is 35, and then that is... I can still move right here, then. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna move right here, and then I'm gonna try and punch it. Uh, I'm not technically flanking it. Ah, oh, whatever. Roll the hit! Let's just see if this happens. Nice. <laughs> I pushed it another five feet back. I, like, right. sidekick it. 
Hold on. So now it's we're over here. We're playing fucking pinball with a werewolf. <laughs> <laughs> I'm we, I'm pissing it off. No, I'm, I'm imagining the uh, like the windows, you know, the windows pinball, like like the space themed one. It's it's like oh, that, yeah. but with the werewolf. <laughs> yeah. All right, that That's is exactly the end of my thinking. turn. <laughs> All right, Bowie, it's up to you. What are you gonna do? Shank the bass. Also, oh, you muted. Bid. Burp. Oh, so you guys don't have advantage on it anymore. Sorry, I didn't get a natural twenty. Okay. God damn it. <laughs> McKinley, I love you. McKinley, shove him in a locker. If you do so... move, you'll get flanking advantage. Flanking advantage, you see. So moving here. Does that get flanking? Might have... No, here. You'd be flanking with Alina. Bruh. You know what? Yeah, might as well. Fuck it. Shank the bastard. Ugh. Roll to hit! The dagger counts as is a dex based weapon and counts as a simple weapon, right? Yeah, it's it's just a basic dagger. Yeah, solar dagger, so it's just dex. Okay, just, just, so that means I get proficiency with it as well, so five. Just, That's just, plus eight. Just add, just, add, just add a dagger to your inventory and then go to the settings, you can, you can make it silvered. It doesn't add anything when it comes to, like, attack or damage rolls, it just means that anything that is, you know, like a werewolf is like, oh. I do know that it's a d6 of damage, so... Yeah, 1d6 plus your dex or strength modifier, but dex, because that's your higher... I know too much about this game. Hey guys, guess who missed again? With oh. advantage. Again. At least if you didn't get a nat 1. It's the same if I miss. It's blech. Anyways, fuck, I can't do the fucking grapple because I didn't make an attack with the compassion, nor did I make an unarmed attack, so I can't even do that either. Yeah, I'm sorry if I sound pissed, but eh. Okay. Yeah, that's gonna be the end of my action. Alright. Alina. Yes. Hi. Hi, friend. That's a miss. That is a miss. Hit me, you won't. That's a hit. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Hit me! Hit me! Oh, fuck. <laughs> you won't. No bulls. Oh, fuck. He had bulls. <laughs> Thought he's taking uh, you to the Bowie, vet. Bowie and Alina both make a uh, strength save. Ouch. Nice. Very nice. Not nice oh, of me. I rolled an eight. <laughs> Yeah, you're right. Alina, you're gonna take ten points of damage. Ow, I'm at six, I'm at seventeen HP now. Oh, uh, Bowie, you take fourteen. Alina, you're knocked back ten feet, which is gonna be over here, and you're knocked prone. Wait, what? What else, what, wait, what else did he hit me with? Because he hit me with the shockwave. What else did he hit me with? Huh? Because you said you said that's a miss, that's a miss, that's a hit. What else did he hit me with? Because oh, he tried to claw at you, and that hit, and I got ten damage. Was that from the shockwave or was that from the claw? You know, he missed with the claws. He hit you with the shockwave. Okay. Um. Ow. You're knocked back ten feet and uh, prone. Uh, buoy, you don't get knocked back. You don't get knocked back or knocked prone. Can someone give me another circle? Yeah. Actually, no, hang on. I... Oh. Beautiful. I figured out that I can copy and paste. Oh, we're, we're, yeah. we're, 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 we're making the blue Olympic rings. Good lord. <laughs> so you get opportunity attack. Bob is rolling now. The dice are being cruel. 
That sucks. God, that, that's really annoying. All right. He is snarling down at you as he chases you down. Uh, Lena doesn't look like she gives a shit. She doesn't... I guess just a very cold look. Yeah, that's no, no way to just describe it. No, now it's your turn. A. Pardon me, but would me and Rook be hit by the shockwave as well, seeing we're, we're within 10 feet of the future? Oh, yeah, you're right. I am a dumb dumb. Make to strength saves, please. Yay. Yay. 18. Do I live? I am. Brooke, you're going to take 18 points of damage. <laughs> and Darius, you take 13. Mm, look at that shitty HP. You are not knocked prone, nor are you knocked back. JT, are you down again? <laughs> JT! <laughs> What she meant to say is you take 12 points of damage. No, no. It's 13. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Don't so worry, sorry. another healing wand. All right, Alina, it's your turn. Uh, I I'm going to risk it. I'm going to risk moving back 10 feet. Which go after the attack against me. Give me a second. So roll that first, so in case if I do go down. Hold on. That's a 23. That hits. How much HP do you have? 17. Okay, you have, you took 7 points of damage as it bit you. She's just gonna just like give like a, a again, just a little like low growl, but nothing much in response. And I'm gonna shoot it twice. All right, do it. That is a twenty. That's a twenty-eight and a thirty-two. Both hit. Let's go. Two D eight plus sixteen. Twenty-four damage. Lois. Yeah. How do you want to do it? Five. Oh, we're holy shit! Yes. <laughs> We almost had another kill. Oh, thank God. Oh, that reminds me, actually. There's that one down was so close. That reminds me, there's one down again. Where, where, where's my composure dice? Also, can we just talk about how many fucking last oh. hits Alina's had? I hate it, but I also Seriously. love it. Like, I hate and also love it because, like, you know. Um, Honestly, that could have easily been any of us with how this battle was going. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, she's pissed. She's She's just straight up pissed. Um, moving back, taking the bite, she's gonna use that kind of, like, I guess, momentum of being bitten to, uh, throw herself around. Um, and she's gonna first, uh, first shoot it in the, uh, in, like, I guess, the gut. Okay. And then, similar to how she shot it with the centaur, she's gonna go right for the eye. All right. You do this, and just like with the centaur, it finally shows signs of pain. It begins to wail and cry as it falls to the ground, clutching at its uh, body, clawing at itself. As it just, you can see the life leaving it, and it's trying to grasp onto what little bit of life it does have left. It collapses to the ground, and collapses to the ground, and. It looks up at you. Its eyes are no longer black and red. It's actually a nice, pretty, bright blue. And you watch this person turn back into the orc that they were before. And with their dying breath, they say, take me to my mother. And you watch as he takes his last breath and he passes away. And without sparing, a, uh, without taking, sp like, uh, skipping a heartbeat, I, do I have, I, I do, I am going over to 
uh, heal Darius with some of the healing stuff that I have. I kind of, like, fall back on my butt and I just kind of am wide-eyed at this entire thing. Yeah. You guys trying are to... pee, I will be... Well, I think pee. I, I'm, I don't know if that pee. I'm visibly trying to process what's going on right now. Like, what just happened. Spare, Spare the dying on Darius, there we go. And... Darius gets back 5 HP. If that brings him back, I can roll again. I got more of these. Is... <sighs> Breathe. Is everyone alright? JT, if that's... I've been hurt worse before. I, don't have... I think JT's AFK. Oh, no. <laughs> no, shit. Oh. No. Oh, is 5 HP no, enough? Can they really be metered around here? No, I was just asking if uh, 5 HP was enough to heal Darius back to revived. There's no overkill in 5 HP. I could take 100 damage and 1 HP would still bring me back up. To <laughs> so you're back? Good. Um, she's just, you know, you know just going to just heal and just kind of put her hand out to help him up. Dilly or Earth from getting shockwaved and clawed in the span of about six seconds, you're going to push himself to a three after several seconds, only noticing her hand afterward, giving a bit of a weak high five at acknowledgement. <laughs> <laughs> also, also, yes, both Alina's eyes are still golden, by the way. I want to point that out. Cool. <laughs> He's just gonna just. Is everyone okay? I'm the only one who didn't get bit. I'm the only one that didn't get bit. Oh my god. Congrats. Don't be the fucking hero. Do you look over to Bowie? Uh, Bowie, do you. Do you think you know anything that can help us? <sighs> I can ask my ancestors, but I'm pretty sure these curses can be cured before the next full moon, if I recall. Later nods. It's too late for me, but you guys have a chance still. But I'm sorry. I was the one who brought you guys here. I was the one who insisted we come and is my fault. I should have come alone. Brooke finally stands up because she was sitting down and <sighs> how is this your fault? Because I'm the one who said we should go here. We should check this out. <sighs> Listen. We as a group decided to do this, Alina. Yeah. Not to mention... You're the one that said we should stay back, that we shouldn't get involved too much in this fight. We should get in the melee range. And look at what happened. They didn't fucking listen to you. Yeah, and look at me, Brooke. As he did any more bloody proof I'm a werewolf. Now look at me. I, I understand that you're upset, but let's at least think about the positives right now. What? How none of us fucking died. Kenneth? We've had Darius Kenneth. down twice. Kenneth. Kenneth! Kenneth, listen to me. Listen to me very clearly right now. As somebody who has been a werewolf the longest, it is a fate worse than death. I would... There are still many nights and many days where I wish I'd rather died back there instead of surviving my encounter. It is no positive. There is no positive that comes out of this. So stop pretending like there bloody is. And she's gonna just kind of just again have this like snarl to her. With that, Kenneth's just gonna actually walk off and like slowly start heading up the stairs without saying a single word. Just clearly, he has a glare in his eye that's like, okay, fine, be upset. He's just not taking it. And slowly Brooke starts heading actually... up the stairs. 
mumbles to herself a little bit. It's pretty inaudible, but Elena could probably hear it. Probably fucking deserves getting bit. Maybe I'll finally teach him something. She's gonna just she's gonna just give a like a a sharp glare to Brock and just but not say anything, but You don't say anything to that? What? <sighs> she's gonna <laughs> No, no, trust me. She, she's thinking of saying something, but right now she's trying to keep her, her composure. Speaking of, where's my dice? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, please. Please let this be the moment. Please don't let this be the moment. You're so lucky. You're oh, so man. lucky. What was 40. What was it? 40. Ugh. Ugh. <sighs> Well, unlike you, we at, we at least have someone who has knowledge of werewolves. At least someone who can keep themselves and possibly others in, in control with their, well, healings and whatnot. Others aren't so lucky to have someone with knowledge of how to prevent certain things. But at least we are. Besides, we might still have some time to actually remove these curses off of our bodies. You do. And if... If we don't, then at least we have you to help us, to help guide us, even if you don't have that much knowledge. She just gives this very cold, just kind of, just laugh, as if there's just no emotion left. Yeah. As if I'm doing a good job at staying alive. <laughs> the thing is, I never fought a werewolf before, and therefore we weren't that prepared for it. At least now we have the knowledge of what to prepare for. Number one item on the shopping list now, silvered weapons. Specifically getting Darius a silver-tipped partisan. I think that would be good. I just, like, I just like stumble back and kind of just lean herself against the wall. Uh... Like, just... Just like she's just thinking. I'm still sorry I brought you guys here. I should have come alone. And then what? Die? Look at me, Brooke. I'm one step away from turning. It's not obvious by the eyes. Yeah, I'm looking at you. But personally speaking here, I will prefer that over you dying, and we never know. One less monster in the world if I'm dead. I'm so glad Kenneth walked away right now. Because <sighs> he's not one to hit a child, but he would hit a child. <laughs> um, so, you know, that's kind of what's going through my mind right now. <laughs> and you, you know what? I am slapping Alina. <laughs> That's rhythm bot. The like, timing, though. Is like, she just is she just gonna take the slap, or should I roll? Uh, I mean, she's not. She's. I mean, she's not really in the like, combat mode, so she she'll probably take it, like not knowing because she's look, she's looking away. If you want to add finesse, move your token closer to her on roll twenty. Eh, doesn't really matter too much, but yeah. Um, I'm. It's not gonna be enough to do some proper damage, but enough to leave a bit of a sting. Mm -hmm. uh, she'll stop and look at me, Alina. Look at me in the eyes. <laughs> She's gonna look up. What? I care about you. Why? We care about you. So stop taking your life so lightly. She just kind of just, like, composes herself a little bit, and just... Just, like, just a deep breath as she's just thinking. Do you mind if Bowie says something? Yeah, she's not saying anything. 
Look, Alina, you have a rare gift, even if you don't see it. Here's the thing. You're suffering right now. Suffering with something that only a few people can, you know, suffer with, I guess. And there are a lot of other people out there who are suffering through the same thing. So why not help a suffering soul so that they don't become you or become those other folks that are out there murdering people? You have the ability to do that, but you can't see it, but you can't see it past, you know, whatever the heck you see yourself as. So why not help a suffering soul before they can turn into whatever you think you are? She just looks over. And kind of just closes her eyes. Open them and opens them again and just... I try. It's so hard to... Wait. She just does, just walks away. She doesn't know what to say. Question Does anyone have rope or any kind of rope to spare? Does Brooke have a rope? Hold on. <laughs> I have a body bag. I do have a rope, <laughs> actually. Um, you're asking that character, right? Yeah. Brooke kind of on her uh, backpack she kind of unhitches some rope from the side of it here take it alrighty time to tie this dead body's you know thing to the fucking rope so that we can drag it along uh, put you know, the hemp in your wishes. inventory you have it now <laughs> the what? rope hempen it... hemp rope Okay. yeah 50 feet Wait, 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 hold up. She's gonna walk over and kind of like crouch down next to it, and she's gonna look at. Uh, she's gonna look around the room. This doesn't make sense. What? No, no, no. It, it. Hmm. That thing near the beginning of the fight. It exclaimed, "I was immune." Now I'm thinking of it, could it have really been about my lycanthropy? Because, like I said, you, you, you can't get cursed twice. That's strange. But... I mean, yeah. to... Wait. This thing's different than other werewolves, though. Yeah. Well, what was in those... That was buckets of blood over there, wasn't it? Yeah. I'm gonna regret this, but I'm gonna go over. And she's gonna just like, I guess, dip her finger and just sniff it and see if it's if it's anything in particular. It's werewolf blood. Not shit, kid. I'll be fine. I'm already cursed. But I was right. You dip your hand in and you smell your finger. Blood is a different strange creature's blood. No. What did you say, JT? You could value your life a little bit more than a copper. Just because you're cursed doesn't mean you have to invite misery into your life. But no, it's it's werewolf blood, not... It literally smells of werewolf blood. And that... I'm not gonna... fucking touch it. But wait, no. He exclaimed I was immune. There's werewolf blood here, buckets of it. And there's a reason... Oh, that's maybe it. No, because, okay, here's the thing. Werewolves, they can't get sick, or at least I haven't got sick, and it's really hard for me to get sick. Because it, the blood, it, it stops you from getting sick. It, it's, it's already, you know, it, it doesn't want you to get, you know, like Anthony, it doesn't want you to get ill because it's already part of your body. And the last thing it wants to do is have more damage to your body if it can help it, so it fights off other diseases. I was thinking about this the other day. This can't be a disease. Unless... The fact, unless you remove the thing that gives a werewolf its immunity, its blood. Hmm. 
Would Bowie actually hear this? Yeah, she's speaking loud enough so everyone can hear. Huh. Well, there's a bag of iron on the pedestal, bucket full of werewolf blood. This guy is all scratched up and shit. Pretty sure I could put two and two together. So. As well as the weird runic circle made out of blood that's upstairs. If this is a disease, oh. it's why I was immune. Because I still have all my blood in my body. If I was bled out, and then whatever curse this was infected me, well, naturally my lycanthropy can't fight it off. Because I'm already... In, because then there's nothing there to fight it off with. Hmm. But he had all his blood drained. This is his normal... This, this is normal werewolf blood. Just like what's in mine. But whatever he had... That's not normal. Have you guys realized this entire place is mainly... Like, there's religion, there's body bags. It's This is not an infirmary. An infirmary would not have this giant-ass area. I'm, there's, there's some type of fucking cult with this, I know for a fact. And Bowie's right, there is a circle up here in blood. I'll see if I can make out anything. I appreciate your input, Captain Novius. At least I'm trying to do something, he says as he gets back into the circle and looks around. Pretty helpful, don't say anything at all, Brooke. <laughs> Just trying to make a yes. shitty, shitty situation feel less shitty. <laughs> Ugh. You're certainly an expert at shitty situations. Although usually you take them the opposite direction. Check your aim next time. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you get called out. I do look at my... I just, I'm like, oh. <laughs> I just shake the head and just... Just... I'll be fine. Just... Just trying to keep my composure a second. Hey, Peach. Hey, what? Is there anything on the ceiling of this room? No, just the same picture as before. Same face, still broken? Yep. Wait, so it's broken in both rooms? Yep. So many fucking ideas. You, if you want to uh, roll perception, anybody, uh, go ahead. Sure. Sure. Perception or investigation, either one. Well, the same no matter what. Twenty-nine. Okay. So with the ones who are down on the ground be rolling perception for the ceiling or just the room in general? Room in general. Uh room in general. Okay. Room as a whole. Oh hey, I'm rolling good for once. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> I can't believe you guys call it to like, yay, we're getting good rolls. Oh, we're about to fight, aren't we? <laughs> Give me a second. This chair. I hate having a character that can't see shit being the person who has like a shit ton of theories. What did you roll? 13. All right. Give me a second. <laughs> Ow. All right. Well, everyone's teleporting. Um, for the ones who are down on the ground, we rolled a twenty. Blah 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 blah. Okay. So for the ones who rolled above a twenty, you would have noticed um that there is another dagger. Um, this time there's one over here, and you noticed another one right here next to all of you by the other chain. Um, as for Kenneth, you would notice that, um, you actually missed a bit of text from, that was on the other mural in the other room. 
you don't know if, if you perhaps just didn't see it in the other room or if it was only in this room, but you do indeed see text. <laughs> it's not in a language you know. Well, due to reworking a character in the background over the past 24 hours, I cast Eyes of the Room Keeper. What? And I don't actually know if that's a cast yeah. thing, because I just it's have not, it. It's a, no, it's an ability that gives you a spell, I think. Yeah, it's not a casting thing. It's just something you can use. Oh, okay. Because I didn't see anything to click, or I couldn't even find it. I had to go under fe features and traits. Yeah. So he says, I have the turnkeeper. Turning attention to helpful things. Oh, you can read all writing. <laughs> you read, for life and death are one, and that even as the river and the sea are one. If anybody is actually like just paying attention to anything, all you hear is like after like as Kenneth is just staring at this mural in the ceiling, noticing the tree behind the woman and just reading this text. Okay, Zahor, what the fuck are you not telling me? What's everyone on the ground doing? I would like to inspect the corpse of the orc, and I'd like to pull my bear trap free of this dead body. Okay. What are you looking for, specifically? I don't know. Loose change in his pockets. He doesn't have any again. pockets. <laughs> Can I grab one of the silver daggers? Yeah. Yay. Can Which I one? to grab one of those for his porting? attackers which one are you um grabbing bro i'm grabbing the one closest to me okay may i make an investigation check to search the entire body at large yeah may i know what the symbols around the teleportation circle say they're not really are they just symbols yeah they're not it's not really a language it's a just the symbols um you don't know what kind of magic this person used to use it um as even as you're standing in it moving around in it and inspecting it nothing is happening um after a bit of inspecting it however you do see that it was smudged a bit most likely when she entered it he damaged it but it's not usable anymore Okay. What are you looking for specifically on the body? I don't know what it has on it, so looking for something that it has on it. Okay, so are you inspecting like like wounds, the body, like clothing? What what is it? Every inch of it, and I think it catches my eye. Okay. Um, it's cool. Yeah. Is there any unusual uh, items have on it? Unusually shaped scars beyond the usual? The okay. deep knife laceration? Stuff like that. So you see along his yeah. torso, stomach, um, lots of blade cuts. Um, some of them look, they're all scarred over. Um, some of them look older, some a bit fresher. And then you see along his arms, um, they are cut, and you're not sure how recent they look, as they have begun to heal, but they don't... As a werewolf, he, these wounds should have been um, healed by now, especially since you know that none of you did these marks, but these all are still bleeding. Fuck it. I'm just going to put my boot on his head and pull my trap free. Not particularly caring about how much pain the bitch was in. <laughs> I mean, he's dead, so he's not feeling any pain anymore. 
And sadly, didn't feel any pain during the fight. I nope. Must be cry every time. Oh, Luna. Hmm? This my back. Keep it. You need it more than I, don't I do. Want to take it back. All right. I'll take it back. Are you okay? Was that a serious question? Yes. Do you know the answer? I'm sorry. This is my fault. Don't fucking do that again. You know it wasn't your fault. You're just the easiest person to blame. It's not a good habit to fall into. Before he died, he asked me to take him to his mother, but... Pami wants to. Pami doesn't. But... She deserves closure, I guess. What'd you say? I'm just here to carry it. Do whatever the hell you think is right. I'm just here to carry this fucker. She's kind of just, you know, like rub her forehead. Better go soon. Feeling. I've never, I've never seen you do this before. It... I'm just gonna just like just think. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't. Why is it? I'm mumbling to myself out loud now. You can rant and ramble all you like later, but right now I'd really not hold a conversation. Understandable. You ought to not with anyone but you. Yeah. It smells like the inside of a pig. Uh, wait, it'll get worse if we stay in here longer, but let's get out of here. I don't want to be around here any longer. Who we can get in contact with our ancestors, the better. So, you guys are leaving? I'm ready to leave. Oh, Jessica, I heard... out of here. Jessica, I heard you say something, but you're muted, so they... I didn't hear what you said. I found out how to turn my volume up because apparently my volume wasn't all the way up and you spoke it and I jumped. <laughs> I gotta turn you down a bit. Good job. Yeah, I know. All right, so say what you said again, JT. Come on, Master Chief, let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I didn't hear what you said. That's why I asked you to repeat it. <laughs> the most important thing to be heard to be said. <laughs> you good there, Lord? <laughs> no. Anyways, right. are we are we bringing this body back that I tied up? Is that in character? Yeah. I think so. Do you guys want to use the body bag? Because I think that would look a lot nicer than just a tied up corpse. Why do you have body? Oh yeah. Never mind. <laughs> Why do you have- oh, yeah. <laughs> I zone out for 10 seconds. What? Body bags. Yeah, we're using oh. the body bag. Oh, God. He hands over the body bag. Hey, it worked out in this situation. Also, I might stay back for a few more minutes. I, uh, I don't know how to explain it, but 
Kenneth. I'll catch up. I'm not gonna stop you. At this point, do whatever you want. Bowie says as he's currently shoving a leg in the body bag. <laughs> so does that mean I can have my rope back? No, the rope stays with the body bag. Who knows if this guy's gonna wake up and revive or some shit. Fair. I mean, then again, they'll stuff in the body bag. Yeah. Uh, anyway, I'll I'll stay back here for a few minutes with Kenneth. I need to get a better drawing of this. All right. Just you two stay safe. I'd rather you don't stay in here too long. You guys got those silver daggers, right? I got one. Yeah. Alrighty. Keep him close. Well, he's gonna head and start heading away out. <laughs> Once the other two have finished stuffing a body into a bag. <laughs> well, do <laughs> <at least. laughs> Yeah, you just, Sentences you, just, you never thought you would have to say. You just currently see Bowie just just trying to shove the orc's head in the body bag and just ends up like, fuck it, tie it up. It's just the head sticking out. <laughs> oh my god. Now All the right. body bag's gonna be, you know, properly used, I guess. Alright, so the ones that are leaving is Darius, uh, Bowie, and Alina? I think so. Okay. Um, I'd like to note that as you, where are you guys going when you leave the room? Before I go anywhere else. I'm, as far as I'm aware, I'm going straight up top and just straight out the entrance. Okay. Uh, as you guys do that and you're walking by the room that contains the um the mimic, you see that the door has been busted down. Um, if you walk as you walk by it and you look inside, the mimic has gone. Well, then. Does it look busted as in it busted out or someone busted in? Busted out. Oh. Okay. Make sure it's not around here again. I'm gonna fucking. I can't hear JT at all. Oh my god. You're lagging a lot. I'm gonna fucking kill it. Make sure it's not around here again. I'm gonna fucking oh kill god. it. Oh my god. Maybe later. <laughs> right now we've got a body to deal with. Alright, what are the two of you doing in the room? <sighs> Hello? Burr, burr. <laughs> I just saw the name update. <laughs> <laughs> Jessica and Kit, what are you doing? I was going. I was gonna let Kit answer first. Um, I'm just getting a better drawing. I uh, because that sketch I got was like shit. <laughs> just finalizing yeah. it and uh, writing down the mar uh, markings on it. And like, did Kenneth tell us what it means or not yet? If she asked, he will. Oh, yeah, Kenneth, do you know what it says at all? Is it one of your languages? He walked over and re-looked at it just to make sure he got it right. For life and death are one, even as the river and sea are one. Huh. All right. And then I'll kind and of write that, that off to, to the side of it. He sits down next to her. There are so many similarities with this. I don't know if I'm going crazy, which isn't out that too much out of the ordinary, or if there's actually a connection here that I'm missing. Because he's going to point to his hand and then point to, like, the tree that she's sketching where half of it's alive, half of it's dead. Because I know there has to be some sort of connection. Roll religion. Him or me? Uh, both of you if you want, but mainly him. Okay. I'm going to do that. I'm my computer to type I can I'll use my phone. 
<laughs> yeah, Look. it makes sense, though. <laughs> it, it makes sense, and considering the amazing roles I got in combat, I deserve that. <laughs> Ten. Oh my goodness. It doesn't take a Brainiac, though, to realize that this is the exact same symbol. I swear, there's something with this. Well, if you think too hard and you still don't get answers, you should probably start, stop thinking. Brooke, you're talking to me. When I don't think, dumb shit happens. When I do think, dumb shit happens. So yeah, well, one's less. Either way. Yeah, well, it's less insufferable when you don't think. You say that, but sometimes I beg to differ. I have too much time on my hands. He didn't think when he fought the eels. Look what happened. <laughs> I'm um, never gonna live that down. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> you're not. It's okay. Just like Brooke is never gonna live down the fucking mice. <laughs> no, I'm never gonna live down the freaking ring. <laughs> or that one. <laughs> Specifically the ring. Oh gosh. Um, But, uh, <sighs> Excuse me. Well, we'll come across the answer eventually, and if we don't, it just means just the answer insane, wasn't it. meant to be shown to us. All right. With as long as I've been alive, honestly, I'm shocked. I'm not having more answers. Okay, Grandpa. I mean, and with that, he slowly gets up and he's going to head to the prayer room and pray to Zahor, but give me a moment so I can think what the fuck he's going to say. All right, uh, we'll go back to the other three. After this interaction between the three of them, we'll end the session. Okay. <clears throat> um, so we're we all still heading out, or we? Gonna go kill a mimic. Uh, no, you don't see any uh, sign of the mimic. You see some blood. Um, once you get to the moss, you can probably tell that the moss probably attacked the mimic, but it most likely broke free and got loose. Well. That's as much as I. Let's just go. There's no point staying. I don't want to be here any longer. Alrighty. Time to go back to the one village thing. It's an hour's walk from here, right? About, yes, if I remember correctly. Let's hope that the other two know the way back. <laughs> uh oh. Brooke, and I think she still has one of those stones left. She'll be fine. Alrighty. And <clears throat> I should have rolled dice for this as well. Haha. <laughs> um. I guess all three of them are uh, the is coming with us as we go outside, or is he gonna stay inside? Yeah, I'm going with you. Okay. I'll try to double check. Um. As they get outside, uh, I think he's gonna just kind of just rub her forehead again, and nearly. Pass out against the against the column. Yeah, right there. Yeah. I. She's just gonna kind of like grip her head, and have her eyes shut. And after like a few seconds, she'll open them, and they're they're back to just normal green and gold, without the both being gold and glowing. Fine. It... It's gone. Think you can make it back? Yeah, just give me a second to catch my breath. You guys, if you guys need to go, 
continue. Don't. I'll be okay. Well, Boo's just gonna look to Darius and just say, Hey, did you leave the kid that saved our life here just alone? We're waiting on you. Come with Fa. We get him patient. She's gonna just pull herself back up. I'll be fine. Let's just go. Don't worry about me. And she's gonna just walk a little bit slower, but still walk in the trail back to the village. Billy's gonna oh. follow. Well. Is Darius going to do anything besides follow? No. No? All right. Then I, that was where we're going to end the session for the night. Hey. Also, Peach, I'm going to message you the prayer that I just had because it's, it's decently lengthy, but after everything that happened, it's something that would definitely be said. So I'm just going to DM you. Okay. You guys did it. No one died. Nearly. Um... Nearly no, no one died. One, nearly no one died. I slapped the child. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Like I was feeling the desire to slap her, and I was like, "Should I do it?" And then Jess mentioned, and I was like, "I'm slapping the child." I will say that was an out of character, but also in character moment for her because, haha, lycanthropy makes you have anger issues. Who knew? <laughs> <laughs> whoopsies you fight it for too long whoopsies it's trying to fight back whoopsies you have anger issues <laughs> whoopsies, <laughs> whoopsies. You, you kind of fight it out with the person who was we don't talk about Brooke's childhood <laughs> I wonder who that woman was man don't tease us right now we, we, no we, we, no <laughs> Peach, you live with me. Do you want to deal with the goddamn consequences? Hey, I, to be honest, I completely forgot about the woman because of how bad my fucking combat rolls were. So It's not your fault. Uh, it was difficult on purpose, and I apologize if it was too difficult. We've all made combats, don't worry. that have gone one yeah. way or another. But that was definitely the most difficult combat encounter we've had. <laughs> but everyone, everyone, uh, say goodbye. Dee dee. God Neat. fucking damn it! Good night, chat. <laughs> yeah, get your records checked out. Also, I hope everyone had a good Valentine's Day. Yee. Yee. Chat. Good night. We love you. Seeing you all. Don't get in trouble. <laughs>